there is some intel inside, so let's hope it won't escape, as today I'm getting rid of this old PC I haven't used in a year. In my world, this means recycling the things I do not need and keeping parts I can use in other projects. Since this is just a video of a guy taking an old PC apart, let me bring the production value slightly higher for you guys, by completing the exercise entirely naked. Let's go. So, what did we get? Lots of plastic and metal that we will bring to the recycling station later on today. A 3 gig ID hard drive, a basic CD-ROM and a 1.44 meg floppy disk player. A 16-bit ISA sound card and the 8-meg RAM motherboard extended with 4 RAM modules to make up for an astonishing total of 24 megabytes of RAM. A 12 volts fan and a pre-ATX Eru power supply that provides 5 and 12 volts. That's a keeper. More interesting historically is the daughter board, showing three older ISA connecting slots and two newer PCI's ports. PCI at this stage was a faster interface that slowly started emerging on the market. Also interesting is the 3 Ethylink 3 network card from 1995. The card is coming from a time where networking was an option, and IP was not always the obvious choice for networking purposes. The card allowed you to choose out of three network attachment types, BNC and coaxial, DB15 or RJ45, the internet cable we mostly use today. The PC is in any cases now gone. But as for now, I should probably get dressed up again or I'm risking catching a cold. <laughs> 